Here it is, my friends. Without further ado, the entire Funko Pop collection. Wow, this is what Giga Chads collect. You feel me? This is a lot of figures, too. This is about 160 figures, maybe a little bit more. You can count them. I think it's 160 even, but I may be off by one or two. Um, but yeah, man, I uh, it's funny. I actually recorded this video the other day, and then I got a package that came in with four of them. Um, then I went to the store and got two more. Um, then a few days went by and uh, I bought another package and the same day the package arrived, which was yesterday, I got four more. So I got six, I got 10 more yesterday. <laughs> so I'm not going to get any for like another month. I, I'm kind of like over it, you know, like, whew, that was a lot. Um, but uh, yeah, this is the whole thing. You know, I, I, I think these shelves can hold a total of 177 figures before I have to do this. So I can hold two rows, 177 on each row. Um, and yeah, so I'm just gonna go through it. I'm gonna make it pretty brief, honestly. Um, I don't know how many people are super into this stuff, but uh, yeah, I'll make it pretty brief. Uh, you know, uh, I'll basically show off the sections too. This is like gaming down here. Then this one is like horror. Then this whole thing is like animation. This whole thing is Disney. This is like the ad icons. This is kind of miscellaneous. And this is all superhero, super villains anime the freddy funkos they're the mascot the freddy F freddy is the mascot of the funko um so they put him as like a bunch of different characters like zombie like uh him in a birthday cake or whatever him this hannibal lecter over there i have some sodas right there they also make sodas um a big some big ones and then some miscellaneous stuff i got two star wars ones as well um but i mean i have a story on like how i got all these i'm not gonna go super into detail this video could easily be over an hour long but hopefully i can get it about 20 minutes or so um so yeah we're gonna start down here you know um this is my most expensive pop in the entire collection. This bad boy is worth about 150 to $200, which is absolute insanity. I just got him the other day. He's one of the ones I got in a box. Uh, I paid, I think, 140 bucks uh, for this box that came with him, these two, and Pale Man. 140 for all that, which is pretty insane because I make my money back and some with this one. Uh, and yeah, this, this is awesome. I'll, I'll get to that. I'll get to that. I got this one yesterday. This is one of the ones I went to a store. You know, I had some cash um, on me and uh, I, I wanted to spend it. So I was like, eh, I'll buy a couple couple stuff, you know, if, uh, if I can find any. And I obviously did find some. And this is one of them, Xenomorph from Alien. I think it's pretty sick. You can see like his little eyes in it. You know what I mean? It's super dope. Uh, Pennywise from It, they have like 20 different Pennywise that you can get. They're also having a digital drop on the 20th, which I find pretty cool. Uh, but they have like a million Pennywise. I just wanted one, you know. I might get the 1990 Pennywise as well, put those next to each other. But yeah, Leatherface, they have a couple different Leatherfaces as well. This is a newer one. I kind of want the old one as well. Uh, this is the old Michael Myers and the new Michael Myers. Pretty cool. Uh, Freddy Krueger, Jason Voorhees. These are both old ones. And then this is the 8-bit Freddy and 8-bit Jason from the original video game. This is what he looks like in the video game. That's why he looks, you know, not like that. He's like uh, blue and purple. And that's why, because that's what he looked like in the original video game. 8-bit. They haven't made 8-bit characters in like five years. They discontinued them. So, you know, you have an 8-bit. It's pretty rare. Not more rare than this one, though. <laughs> um, yeah, Demogorgon from Stranger Things. I'm actually two episodes away from finishing that entire, you know, fourth season. Uh, so uh, I really like the show. I'm, I'm messing with it. Pale Man this is from Pan's Labyrinth. He's got eyes on his hands, and he puts that over where his eyes should be. Super cool character. A Leprechaun from like an old like 1980-1990 movie. Sam from Trick or Treat. La Llorona from uh, obviously La Llorona. Uh, Candyman. Uh, Patrick Bateman from American Psycho. Fantastic movie. Um, and Jack Torrance from The Shining with this red rum case on it. I think that's super cool. This is super unique, man. This blood and this red rum thing are like the only two pops ever that have like blood on the you know box which i think is super cool really like this one this one was pretty cheap well i got him yesterday as well 
Um, yeah, I got the Xenomorph yesterday. I got uh, Jack Torrance yesterday. And I got Steve yesterday. <laughs> uh, but yeah, Frankenstein, these are universal monsters. I got Bride of Frankenstein and Frankenstein. Steve from Minecraft, you know. My main channel is a Minecraft channel, so how to get him. They have a ton of ones, man. I think they have a Creeper, a Skeleton, Steve with Armor, Steve with Enchanted Armor, Steve with Gold Armor. Uh, I think they have one of Alex. I mean, they got a bunch of Minecraft ones. Uh, this is now the gaming section, by the way. Uh, Pikachu, uh, Chase, Cuphead, King Dice. Um, Cuphead's a fantastic game, but what's cool about what Funko Pops do is they, um, they, they'll they put these on like their website or something, and when you buy them, you either have the chance to get the common, which looks like this, you know, he's got a purple outfit, or you get the chase, and you don't know what you're going to get until you, you know, you get it, until it arrives, you don't know what you got, and uh, yeah, I mean, I just bought this up front, I didn't buy it from their website, but uh, yeah, this is the chase, which means it's more rare than, you know, the common, which is pretty cool. Hello Neighbor, pretty decent game. Not a huge fan of it. Um, actually, I, let me tell you a story now that's on my mind. Uh, we went to a shop a while ago and we bought like three pops. It wasn't really anything crazy, just three pops. And they gave us a red ticket. And they said, okay, with this red ticket, you know, um, if you win, we'll call you and you'll get $250 of in-store credit for free. And uh, we actually won. <laughs> So we went to the store, you know, we spent the whole 250 bucks because it's like, you know, it's a long ways away. So I was like, eh, let's go ahead and do it. Got that guy for free. Uh, this is another one we got for free. Um, there's a lot we got for free, obviously, 250 bucks. I can't remember every single one. I don't think it's any more of these horror ones or game ones. Um, I know there's some up above that we got for free, so I'll let you know. But yeah. Girlfriend got me this one. Girlfriend got me actually quite a few of these. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is one that she got me. Uh, the Spartan Grenadier with uh, with HMG from Halo. Pretty sick. All the new wave Five Nights at Freddy tie-dye ones. I really want some older Five Nights at Freddy's ones. But uh, I'm really liking these. I think these look super cool. All these tie-dye Five Nights at Freddy's figures. Pretty sick, man. So, you know, these are kind of horror as well. But they're more video game, so... Maybe that'll change after the movie comes out. Maybe people will think it's more horror and not a video game. So yeah, this is my animation one now. Um, I do realize that these are more Disney than they are animation, but uh, I don't really feel like putting figures on top of others right now. And you know, that's what I would have to do because I only have room for one more. And so I was like, well, I'll just put an animation, you know, who cares? They're also the black light version, which means all of these glow in the dark. I have the entire set of the um, Nightmare Before Christmas ones. So that's pretty cool. Uh, Toothless from How to Train Your Dragon. This is another one we got for free from that 250 Grinch in underwear. It's pretty cool because he has like a frowny face in his coffee. I think it's sick. This is like a $50 pop, which is pretty cool. Um, yeah, that one down there is $40. i am just thinking of the prices now. Oh, yeah, that's Mr. Chimes, by the way. I didn't point him out, I don't think. Also from Cuphead. But yeah, Strawberry Shortcake got this, you know, a week ago maybe. Um, it's the only scented pop I have, which is pretty crazy to have 160, and this is the only scented one I have. But uh, yeah, and it's super cool. She's sitting on some strawberries, you know, super cute. I mess with it. Uh, Flocked Eduardo, I also got him and him for free uh, from that 250. Uh, this is super cool. Flocked basically means they have like like fur, like hair on them instead of just being plastic. Uh, that's what Flocked is. You'll see a couple more of those, I believe. I have a couple of those. Um, and yeah, that's what flock means. Uh, Mac, also from Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends. Two Scooby-Doo's, one's for my girlfriend when she gets her room all set up. You know, we just moved into this house not too long ago. But once she gets that all set up, you know, I'll give her the extra one. I have a couple duplicates like these two Tommies. She'll get the Tommy too if she wants it. Uh, but yeah, Chucky, you know, I have the whole Rugrats, all the Rugrats characters, except for Reptar himself. They have one of just Reptar, which is pretty cool. The Count, this is, I think, my third most expensive one in my collection. This guy's worth $100, uh, which is pretty cool. It's from, uh, you know, Sesame Street, obviously. And he's super old, man. Super old pop. Super cool. I mess with it. Really like it. And uh, yeah, worth a good amount, which I think is pretty cool. All the turtles from Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Donatello, Michelangelo, Leonardo, Raphael. 
Frankenbob from Minions. I don't know. I just thought this was really cute. They have a whole line of a bunch of Minion, like, horror characters, like Bride of Frankenstein and, you know, stuff like that. I thought it was cute. I was like, why not? Some Adventure Time ones, Jake the Dog, Finn the Human. These are newer ones. They have older sculpts as well. And Princess Bubblegum. Homer and Hedges from that meme where he backs up into the hedges. Oh, dang, man. I hit that one hard. Moved the whole thing. Uh, yeah, where he backs up into the hedges. Entertainment Earth exclusive. And then Appa from Avatar, which is pretty cool. Now we're moving on to Disney. These are all Disney. That is two, but you know what I mean. Um, so we got Princess Minnie uh, that I got in a mystery box, actually. Uh, Philhar Magic Mickey, which I bought along with this autographed Boo. I bought the whole box. It was Boo, I think six other pops, maybe it was seven other pops. And three sodas for $130. Absolute insanity because this autograph boo goes for $130. So just an insane deal you can find, you know, on these on these platforms where people are selling stuff. Uh, I choose Mercari. Uh, I found so many good deals. That's also how I got that Billy. Bought that Billy and, you know, those two and the Pale Man for super cheap because I just, you know, asked the person on Mercari if I could have all those for you know, that much money. And they were like, yeah, that's fine. So <laughs> I took a W there, but uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Snow White, a uh, hundred anniversary edition, evil queen. You know, I have these three together, grumpy glow in the dark Hades Two Maleficent's. I think this is an older one and a newer one. Tiana, Captain Hook and Cart, got that from Mystery Box as well. A bunch of stuff from Beauty and the Beast, Cogsworth, The Beast, and Wardrobe. A bunch of Pinocchio pops, uh, Jiminy Cricket, Pinocchio, and Geppetto. Uh, solely with Boo, and then my autographed Boo, obviously autographed by the voice actress that plays Boo. Super cute, you know, it says Kitty, you know, written by Mary Gibbs. Super cute, man, I really like it. This is the coolest one I have. Uh, it's also the second most expensive in my whole collection, which is pretty cool. I have the Common and Chase Darkwing Duck. Again, like I was saying, I actually did order these two, and I had no idea if I would get a Common and a Chase. That's what I hoped for. I hoped I didn't get two Commons in the box, and I didn't, man. I got a Common and a Chase, which is pretty cool. This guy's worth like 40, 50 bucks, not too much. This guy's worth like 20. Uh, Pride Goofy, this guy's worth like 35 bucks. Uh, pretty cool. I got this in the same box that I bought this in. So, you know, that was an extra and uh, I like it, man. It's pretty cool. Funko Hollywood exclusive. Pretty sick. This is Halloween Goofy Glows in the Dark Entertainment Earth exclusive. Benson 2019 Fall Convention. Uh, from Toy Story 4. Buzz Lightyear, I'm eh about this. You know, if it was the OG Buzz Lightyear from Toy Story, I'd probably like it a lot more, but you know, it's okay. I don't mind it. Wally and Eve, um, I got these for free also, which is pretty crazy. Um, they're both come in, came in protectors. I didn't put them in a protector. They're not worth that much for me to put in a protector. Obviously, this one's in a protector. I need to put him in a protector. He's not even in a protector worth that much and he's not even in a protector i need to do that take one off of you know this guy put it on there that's what i did for billy i took it off something else uh but yeah wally and eve classic battle nateri from the new avatar way of the water elastigirl fye is exclusive and then this um black and white you know half black and white half colored mickey mouse i got this at the same time as i got the strawberry shortcake so that's pretty cool so that's my whole disney section man we're halfway done we got three more to go this is my superhero super villains. Um, yeah, this one is really cool. It's the 30th anniversary of, I think, Harley Quinn? Like Harley Quinn's existence, I think? I'm not sure. It says 30. If that means 30 years. I don't know what it is. I guess it's Harley Quinn. Um, I'm, I should shut my window back there. But uh, yeah, I got two Harley Quinns, three Jokers, a Riddler. You know, it's funny. They're all from Batman. Uh, Batman's a great movie, though, man. Uh, but yeah, this one's really cool. It's her sitting on top of cards, a bunch of playing cards. Really cool. You know, this one's pretty cool as well. This is one of the first Funko Pops I ever got. Uh, Joker with Kisses. Um, 1989 Joker. Joker is Santa. Riddler from LA Comic Con. Venom. This is the Spider-Man from the new Across the Spider-Verse movie. I just picked this up yesterday as well. Uh, and then all four of those I got from a mystery box I ordered the other day. And that came with it. That was like the big pull from the mystery box. That one's worth um, like 40 bucks, which is pretty cool. 
Uh, so yeah, I got Vigilante, Black Panther. I actually love this one, man. The character looks so sick. And it sits on top of this thing, lights and sounds. If you took it out of the box, which I don't do, but it's got like, um, you know, a button on the side. You click the button and it makes light, and you know, it lights up and it makes sounds and stuff. Really sick, man. Really cool. It's worth like 30 bucks, which is pretty cool. Uh, Sinestro. Uh, this is from Green Lantern. I had no idea where this was from. Mighty Thor from uh, the new Thor movie, Love and Thunder. Pretty cool, you know, I don't hate it. I got it from a mystery box, so you know, I don't really care. These aren't characters I probably would buy, you know, on my own, except for that Spider-Man. I did buy that Spider-Man though. Uh, but yeah, I got these from a mystery box and uh, I probably wouldn't buy them on my own. I'm not a huge superhero, super villain guy. Well, I'm a huge super villain guy. Not a huge superhero guy, so. You know, these are cool. They're not duplicates, which is good. And you always worry about that when you get a mystery box. Am I gonna get one that I already have? I didn't, so um, that's a W, man. These are kind of miscellaneous. They're not in a section, you know, some Warner Brothers. Uh, they did these for the 100th anniversary of Warner Brothers. They put, they combined uh, Scooby-Doo characters with uh, Looney Tunes characters. And they have a bunch more of these. These are the only ones I have though. And then Mini Puff from Ghostbusters, pretty sick. Ad icons, I want a lot more ad icons. There's just a lot more that I want. Um, ad icons are pretty sick. You know, I got Kool-Aid Man, uh, Bullseye, Target, uh, Pillsbury Doughboy, uh, Mac and Cheese, which is weird. Polaroid Camel, which is also weird. Polaroid Camel is like 50 bucks, which is pretty interesting. Uh, I got this one from Disney, actually. I got it at the Coca-Cola store, so that's pretty cool, man. Uh, Energizer Bunny. Uh, this is the pop we bought, actually, when we got the ticket uh, to get the free stuff for $250, which is pretty sick that we actually won that. And then two Ronald McDonald's, OG, and then rock out Ronald McDonald. So up here's my anime. I'm not going to go all the way up there. I could sit on a stool and tell you, but I'm just going to tell you like this. So Jujutsu Kaisen, I got Satoru Gojo, Box Lunch Exclusive, two Itadori's. I got that one down there for free. That one's from Hot Topic Expo. This was really cool too. If you've seen the movie, um, he's got Sukuna on the side of his face. So that's just a pretty cool one, you know, and the Mojito. And then I got a bunch of All Mights. I got six All Mights because I saw this on Mercari. I've never seen My Hero Academia, but uh, they were selling six All Mights for 45 bucks. And these are all worth 150 together. So I was like, oh my God, I have to get that. That's pretty sick. Uh, this is my girlfriend's Altered Carbon. I don't know anything about that show. Hunter Hunter, I've got like pretty much every character. <laughs> um, they released a new wave of them. So I don't have that, but I have like all the main characters. Uh, Attack on Titan, I got Levi and Amir. And then Demon Slayer, I got Tanjiro with Noodles, which is the new one. And then I got, you know, Rui and Muzan and Inosuke, Nezuko, Zenitsu. So those are pretty cool, man. And then up here, this is a miscellaneous section. I got Ozark Pops. Uh, I'm on the final season of that show. Uh, it's pretty good. You know, it's not, it's not crazy. Season two was really good. Uh, I'm on season three right now. And so, eh, uh, hopefully it picks up in season four, but... Yeah, and then I got Princess Leia in my mystery box the other day as well. Uh, I got the Flock Chewbacca. I got that when I was at Disney. Got Groot. Got the Masked Worker from Squid Game. I got this big deluxe, you know, Tinkerbell from Peter Pan. I got this from Disney as well. Mickey Mouse on the Haunted Mansion buggy. Super cool. It's like a $70 pop. I got this from Walmart the other day, this uh, Justice League one. It's got the comic in the back, and then it's got all the, like, mini pops. Like, there's like six of them in there. It's pretty cool. They're all taking down um, Starro the Conqueror. I have no idea what that is. Some sodas, you know. And then this is my Freddy Funko section. All the, you know, Freddy is the mascot of Funko. So I got three sodas. And then those three actually came from a Fright Night box. Which I have the box. Um, but I'm not going to pan over to it. But I have the box that they came in, which was pretty cool. It looks like kind of like a cereal box. It's pretty sick. You can look it up online. But yeah, I got Freddy Funko as Hannibal Lecter on the right, then Freddy Zombie, then Freddy as Spirit. That's a DIY soccer Freddy. Uh, so if you took it out of the box, you could paint it, you know, DIY. Uh, Yuletide Freddy, which I got in the Christmas Mystery Box. Anniversary Freddy, which I got yesterday in the 25th Anniversary of Funko Mystery Box. And then those sodas also came in the Friday Night thing. So yeah, man. Um, believe it or not, this 20 minute video was quick. I could have gone a lot more in detail. But uh, yeah, man, that's my whole collection. Pretty sick, man. I like it. A lot of cool stuff in here. And uh, yeah, man, it looks like a lot. But to me, it's like, man, I thought I had a lot more than this. <laughs> but you know, it's pretty cool. It sits in my room next to, you know, where I game and stuff. And uh, yeah, I like it. It's pretty sick. So yeah, that's my whole collection here.
I'll do this. Hope y'all mess with it. Hope y'all like it. Let me know uh, how many you have in your collection or you know what you do. I don't mind how absolutely horrible my soundproofing is. I'm going to fix that. But yeah, that's it. And uh, yeah, man. All right. Thanks for watching.